last time, as you see, for like or dislike, where we go thumbs up or thumbs down on the stories we've all been sharing. Miley Cyrus has dropped a hot new song entitled, It's a Liberty Walk. It's, quote, dedicated to the thousands of people who are standing up for what they believe in. She's referring to people involved in the Occupy movement. And the video for her three-minute dance track features hardcore club beats against footage of <laughs> Occupy protests from around the globe. I it's love the juxtaposition. So edgy. It so is edgy. edgy. I it just is. want you guys to know that I'm really proud of Hannah Montana for believing in something. I Has she even been to one of these Occupy? That's what I want to know. That's not she important, Shay. Tweet her, Shay. Tweet Has her. she Detail. been down there? Listen, this is what I say so to that. So you like or This is what that. I say that because I think young women should be allowed to have opinions about this without the people making fun of them. Without being judged because they're known I for believe. being a certain right, way. Right, exactly. Good for her for having an opinion. I don't, I mean, I, I think it's great. I want to know, I mean, if, if she does have that opinion, that's what I want to know. I want to know that she really, like, believes in what she's what trying to say. What else would she have to do? What, uh, she to might be just she, trying to sell some songs. Should she stay out there yeah, for a night? Yeah, because that's what sells songs. <laughs> yeah, right. Have really pictures like that. No, right, I so think we, that's fantastic. I want to know if she's been down vote. there. We had some viewers vote, and they're both about 50-50. Some like, some dislike this. But a lot of her comments on our YouTube channel have been very positive. We had uh, Miles of Red wrote, until recently I dismissed Miley Cyrus as just another annoying Disney brat, but now I have total respect for its grown leaps and bounds for her support for the Occupy movement. So she's using her celebrity for good. A lot of people are seeing admiring another that. side of her. Yeah, I mean, that's really. We all know she. We already know that. Well, she might smoke to smoke a bit, so maybe. A little, bit <laughs> that's of a little bit of sexual controversy. Put a political controversy. She's growing up. All right, and speaking of uh, something that's growing up and moving on to something else, the real office supply store Staples has made a deal with the that's, fictional paper seller. Awesome. Dunder Mifflin from the TV show The Office. I Actually, they did the deal with NBC's parent company, but pretty soon you'll be able to order Dunder Mifflin brand copy paper online for a premium price. The packaging will be marked with classic slogans like our motto is quality first. That's not a mess up in my teleprompter, yeah. by the way. And get your scrant on. So, Julia, overpriced paper for Dunder Mifflin. Yeah, I mean, like or dislike? I like it, and I feel like I know what my Christmas presents are going to be now. I'm not joking. Yeah. That's a fun this thing for an office. No, I'm not even. She was like, yeah. what? No, I'm serious. <laughs> I'm actually going to get this for my little brother. No, <laughs> I'll be like, this is Julia. what you get. Here's what's this interesting. This is an ugly Christmas sweater. These, these are like 30-something bucks for a totally thing. Totally worth it. But like the regular paper is like seven bucks. I always wonder who buys, what's, they hate thirty dollars on paper so these totally. days. Totally, people so in weird. offices. This is going to be a super yeah. popular office present for Christmas parties. So yeah. like or dislike? I think it's great. Great, great, great way to make some money. Staples Most and NBC. of our viewers who <laughs> voted dislike this. What? It's, it's, yeah. Is it a waste? Well, people I think, think a lot a of people aren't really into the office anymore. We have the Nerve.com. Oh, really? It's a sex and relationship site. At yeah. Nerve tweeted, it took Staples this long right. to come up with this idea. Talk about striking the iron when it's right. cold. So I was thinking, I thought I they the already had this. Gone. I thought you could already buy Dunder Mifflin. No, we only report about new things, Shay. Uh, yeah. It's whenever okay. trendy. <laughs> Don't it's question trendy that. <laughs> That's why I mean, you're right. They're totally late on this. They're like Another new thing, if you're a big fan of the Nintendo Wii, then you might want to stop by the exhibit bar in South London when you're doing, you know, a little yeah. stroll after the show to try their new urine-controlled video games yes. for men only. Sorry, <laughs> ladies. With the exception of the controller you were born with, the games are completely hands-free. Players are able to post their scores to Twitter and compete with friends through a live leaderboard. That's Chase, awesome. Chase, scoring this, while you pee, like or dislike. This is going to increase beer sales by 28% <laughs> <laughs> like, across the board. I need to pee. Like, bro, I got the high score on urinal three. <laughs> Beat that sucker. Chug, chug, chug. Yeah. <laughs> I'm really disappointed that I don't have a Y chromosome just for this particular this. moment. This is another thing where I'm like, where has this been? We should have this years ago. This is amazing. In your dreams, <laughs> so, literally. Like or dislike? I mean, I just am disappointed yeah. that it just doesn't come for women. Unless we learn how to do it standing up. I don't think that that's going to happen. Those no. are the advanced levels. You know what? Wait. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> yeah, There's the bonus pack. Bring a woman on board. Get extra points. Right. <laughs> that's awesome. No, I like it. Yeah. Two thumbs up. All right, well, uh, our viewers are voting. Mostly dislike this. I'm not sure what the gender That's was. Your though, viewers are very viewers. negative people. Um, <laughs> but something, something important to know on the business side of things, the creators of the game, they're, they're a captive media, they say the device allows for around a minute-long opportunity to reach targeted young men with advertising. A minute? Is that how long it takes? So it's not just about <laughs> Men having fun at the urinal. <laughs> I was hoping that it increased and accuracy kind of too, you know, so there's not as much slash. Aim is important. Yeah, yeah. exactly. It's oh, you're talking about right? aim, we're talking about time. Well, it's just, I don't know. What, anyway. I, I feel really awkward. All right, well, you guys were both great today. <laughs> oh, thanks. You're both, oh, you are real, you are professional.
You can keep up with Shea Carl and Shea Tards at SheaCarl.com and Julia Allison is easy to follow on Twitter at Julia Allison or by checking out her life cast on nonsociety.com. Please keep letting us know your thoughts and questions by tweeting us at What's Trending using hashtag WTLive.